the Conservative Party has paid for a Twitter advert attacking a former Labour MP who was defeated by the Tories in 2019. The embarrassing gaffe was an attempt to bring voters' attention to border issues across the country. In the advert, former MP Jenny Chapman is depicted as your MP, who voted against the borders bill. Taking to Twitter to highlight the error, Henry Zeffman wrote, Conservatives ramping up attacks on Labour MPs who voted against the borders bill. Only issue with this one is Jenny Chapman hasn't been the MP for Darlington since December 2019, when the Conservatives defeated her. The original advert paid for by the party read, they voted to keep illegal migrants in Britain. Your MP voted against the border bill, which takes back control of our borders, allows us to remove those who are here illegally, and tackles channel crossings. It ended with the words, you can't trust Jenny Chapman. Mr. Zeffman was not the only person to mock the blunder. James Metcalfe said, the Conservatives really do take voters' support for granted, so much so they don't even know which seats they represent before spreading the disingenuous graphics. Speaking of the actual MP for Darlington, Peter Gibson, Mr. Metcalfe continued, Darlington deserves better than an MP who's so absent, even his own party have forgotten about him. This was backed up by Indie Bookshop who said, it's because Peter Gibson is so bland and follows the party line that HES forgettable, even by his own party. Worried about the integrity of the advert, Ben said, surely this is the sort of campaigning that should be reported to the Electoral Commission? Mr. Gibson himself became involved in the affair taking to Twitter to set things straight. He said, turns out it was a computer glitch, now resolved. Undoubtedly had we not turned Darlington blue in 2019 it would have been accurate. Ms. Chapman currently holds the position of Shadow Minister of State at the Cabinet Office and has been made a life peer. She lost her seat to Peter Gibson in 2019 in a close vote during the so-called Tory Red Wall sweep. Mr. Gibson secured 20,901 votes to Ms. Chapman's 17,607.